Second period and the third period. Uh, obviously, Yale put that behind them early in the go. Made a huge play here on a turnover to capitalize to get that game winning goal in overtime. Nine seconds in officially Yale beats the top seed Minnesota. It is the eighth consecutive year that a four beats a one under this format. First team is in one of the top goaltenders. McWilliam winds up and shoots and scores. Andrew McWilliam ties the game. Well, a big shot from the point, and surprisingly, this was a poor goal that gets behind Chubek as he's been phenomenal all game, but McWilliam with a bomb from the point. The captain, the leader on this team, gets the puck up off the dash, lets her fly. There's some bodies in front. I'm not sure if Chubek didn't see it, but we'll get a good look here as McWilliam gets a good opportunity off the glove. Shot. Now throws it in front. It's Crystal shooting at a save. Crystal wraparound scores. Lightning strikes and North Dakota leads. Wow, what a great job by Coach David Axel to change up the lines between the second and third period. He got the energy going on this team. And Danny Crystal shows you why he may be the best player in college hockey here. He gets the puck off, off his skate controls it, fires it, then he controls it off the rebound, makes a nifty move to his backhand, and finds the post before Chubek can get it. This is just sick. What a play to his backhand, quick wraparound. Beautiful.